Local news for Monday the 28th of September. Martin Burroughs Aspect Architecture has been chosen as lead architect to design Masterton's new animal shelter after assessment and of the three tender proposals. Chief Executive Kath Ross said the council was pleased to be able to buy local and utilise the Wadded Upper business for the project. Construction expected to begin after tendering for a contractor is in the second half of 2021. Fire crews were called to Blair Logie at about four o'clock on Friday after a fire started in a forestry block. The crew spent a good portion of the weekend there. Meanwhile, emergency services were called after a car was found submerged in the Waipo River just after 7am yesterday morning. Police are concerned that someone may have gotten out of the vehicle and got into trouble in the water. Anyone who witnessed the crash or may have other relevant information are asked to contact police. And power was cut to residents in Wainawa and Solway yesterday for the first outage at 5.30 in the second and 6pm. Strong winds buffeted the region and caused a tree to fall on a house in Solway, while shortly after crews were called out to a car accident at Homebush. And in sports, Wadadapa Bush have won the inaugural uh, uh, Meads and Lahore Scroll, beating King Country 22-18. Wadadapa United have claimed the Kelly Cup after beating Waterside Karori 1-0. And both Dalefield men's and women's hockey teams have won their respective Wellington competitions. And Harcourts are the 2020 netball champs in what's been a bumper weekend for what it up is sport. Kia ora. For local news and sport, I'm Brink here.